All right, welcome to today's video. Today I'm going to be playing Contra Hardcore on the Sega Genesis Mini Classic, whichever, however you, which I don't know if it's Mini or is it Classic. Anyway, I'm playing on the plug and play system of the Sega Genesis. Three, two, one. Contra Hardcore. This is a very, um, this is very much a hardcore version of its contra because Jap the the Japanese version has a life bar where you can get hit by you can get hit up to three times before you die but on in true contra fashion for North America they gave us one hit death kills so it's a little hard it's a little unfair but I uh, I prefer to play uh, the Japanese version because they do have the Japanese version on this uh, plug-and-play system here but anyway, uh, I'm going to do the North American version just for the sake of, you know, being in North America and for this video as well. But if I, when I do, uh, whenever I do a long play of this, I think I'm going to be doing the uh, Japanese version because I think that'll be more enjoyable. Because, like, I have no idea how I'm going to be able, if I want to play this on hard, I'm going to have to play this in the North American version. Usually they make things easier for the North American audience, but apparently not with uh, Contra. Oh, ah, son of a gun. One hit, one, one hit kill. See that? And yet they make Mega Man 2 easy for uh, the North American audience on the NES Mega Man 2. Oh. Okay, let's get rid of this truck here. The good thing about explosions like that is that when you stand close to them, they don't hurt you. Because you're a superhero. Whoop. Whoops. Okay, there we go. You know, like, uh, what do you call it? They say there's some lag, like, um, on some of these games here. But I haven't, I don't really notice it with, uh, Contra. So far, so good. Oh, man. I If I knew that this game was was as awesome as the Super Nintendo counterpart, I would have brought this game for the uh, Sega Genesis. Because I did have a Sega Genesis when I was a kid. It's just that I didn't, I never knew there was a Contra game out for it. See, like, little kid me would have just, you know, been eating this up. Check it out. There's a giant, like, robot in the background there. He's just, he's setting the city on fire. And it's up to me to shoot him in the eyeball. Get over here. Okay, we'll just shoot him up here. Whoop. I think I'm safe. Yeah, I am safe. I like how he dances around. He's a little too happy with his uh, destruction of humankind here. And down you go. Goodbye, dancing robot. Okay, moving on. And the good thing is when you you look at this, I got like four separate uh, weapons. I got laser. I got uh, oh the the C thing. I forget what it's called. The grenade. Ooh, and the classic spread shot. And the homing missile. I'm gonna stick with the homing missile for now. Okay, let's jump on here. You know, the first time I heard that uh, this game existed was um, was actually not that long ago. I mean, like I um. What is going on here? Okay. Yeah, I think it was about just a little under 10 years ago I, I heard that this game existed. That's not the unmanned robot. Somebody is inside that thing. Well, you, you're a soldier. I think you are used to... I think you have killed people before. If I'm not mistaken. I don't... Well, not every soldier has killed... I'm pretty sure that there is a few that served duty and that only fired at um, at the enemy or just guarded their post. I I don't know. I'm just speculating on what uh, people in the army do. Oh, I've never felt the uh, urge to join the the military. Die! Die already! Got him! 
<laughs> He's got such a little villainous laugh. What or who are you? Yeah, you can call me Dead Eye Joe, not Cotton Eye Joe, Dead Eye Joe. If you want to know more than that, then come and get me. The research center is under attack by an unknown group. Please come and help. Damn, what should I do? Okay, should I go after Dead Eye Joe or rescue the... I guess I better go rescue the research center. Whoops. All right. Stage clear. Okay, let us go check out... Let's go on our way to the research center. Oh. Okay, it's one of these. Damn, at this speed, we'll never get there on time. Hey, bro, looks like you're having some trouble. Grab onto my machine and I'll take you to where you want to go. The air police. You guys sure have a good... You guys sure have good timing. Look out. One of the bad guys is coming from be, up from behind. Oh. Okay, let's use this thing. Whoa. Whoa. Kablooey. Whoa. Okay. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, gotcha. And also, I didn't realize that... Uh, well, I, I kind of knew that there was uh, a Castlevania for the Sega Genesis, but because I didn't... I, can't recall seeing screenshots of it back in the day or how it played. I just, you know, it just didn't, um, it just didn't pique my interest. Oh, what's this dude here? I remember him. Oh, no, I touched his spinning blade. Okay. Oh, got him. Good old spread shot. Oh, he's after me. He's a rocket. He's a rocketeer. Rocket man. Whoa, you missed. Can't go wrong with a spread shot. Homing missile, I would have liked to use more on this guy, but uh, I got myself killed. I only, I got no more lives left either. Goodbye. Okay, what's next? Oh, ah, right off the bat. Oh no, a game over. Well, I guess you know what that means. And I use up one of our continues. Okay, I shall go with the girl or Wolfman Jack. Oh, a little robot dude. I'll go with the girly. Sheena. She has a jungle name. Damn, at this speed, we'll never get there on time. Whoops. Hey, bro, looks like you're having some trouble. Oh, yeah, he's saying the same thing. Okay. The air police. You guys sure have good timing. Look out, one of the bad guys is coming up from behind. Yeah, same thing. I got my standard pea shooter. Should suffice for these enemies. Oh. Goodbye. The only thing, the only tricky thing is I'm gonna have to uh, try and kill that uh, rocketeer guy. At least I still have three lives. Whoa. Okay, where, where is that? Where is that dude? Where is that dude? Come, 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 get some. Yeah. Okay, gotcha. Whoops. I think it's better to try aim where he's going. Okay, he's kind of going, kind of has a little pattern here. At least he's not coming up to destroy me. Okay, not to shoot at him. Watch out for his laser eye. Gotcha. Oh, that was pretty quick. That was faster. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, okay. There's a button here I can... Whoa! Rats! We took one. We're going down. It'll be a rough landing. I think that's what the last line said. 
Nope. Weapons! Okay, what is this? Okay, the laser. Wait a minute. This laser seems different. It's like a long laser. And this one. Ooh, spread laser. This is awesome. I'm going to use this for a while. I guess I'll just stand here. There we go. She has no hair left. There's so much fire. Hey, it's Mr. Miyagi. Are you okay? I'm fine, but you must stop them. They're after the alien cell. Alien cell? We got it from the mother alien in the alien wars five years ago. Oh, I wonder if this is a... I wonder if this is kind of like the sequel to Contra 3. So this would be the original Contra 4 then. But there's already a Contra 4 on the Nintendo DS. Well, anyway, it's very dangerous. So we're going to keep it. We're keeping a close eye on it. So the rampaging robot was just a clever diversion. Whoops. Okay. Let us go. Shoot my crazy. Oh, look at this. It's going all over the place. Man, that's that's a crazy weapon right there. With the amount of ammo I'm shooting, it would just be deadly in real life. Homing lasers. Okay, let's climb up here. Oh. This is an awesome weapon. I hope I don't die easily and accidentally lose it. Okay, we got that. Whoa. Alright, I hope I don't get a weapon and that replaces it. Oh no, I'm too late. Okay, now I gotta fight whatever is gonna come my way. Oh, 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 ah! She, she squeaked. Oh. Oh, oh. I think he's almost dead. Oh, got him. Laser works pretty well. Stage clear. Yes. We did it. Okay, three days later, we identified the hacker who breached our security. His name is Neumann Cascade. Neumann? He's the best hacker on the net. He used the panic caused by the robot as a diversion so he, so he could steal the mother alien cell from the research center. It's very likely there is an organization working behind him. His hideout is under a garbage dump. Don't screw this one up. Alright. Oh. There we go. Kablooey. This is a crazy weapon. Look at it. I'm shooting like blue and red balls. You guys are no match for my clown balls. Okay, time to go forward. Oh, I was going to say, I'm going to play until uh, I get another game over. So uh, I'm going to try not to get myself killed here. Everything is a weapon in this game. Oh, oh, oh. You miss me. Did you miss me? With every bullet so far. Oh. Whoa, -oh. something's coming. It's a garbage demon or a garbage robot. What's his. Oh, I was gonna say, what is his attack? Oh, son of a gun. Well, that was quick. Well, I'm going to do what I said and I'm going to close off the video at my second game over. Well, let's see. Let's pick this little guy here for our closing. Okay. Well, look at him. He's so cute. And he shoots triangles. Anyway, so this was today's video. I hope you enjoyed uh, Contra Hardcore. 
as much as I enjoyed ma playing it and making this video. And we will catch you next time with a different game. So until then, we'll see ya. Have a good one. Bye bye.